Is it wrong to think of God as a power or force rather than a being? Does it matter that God is a, a being rather than a force in the universe? The Star Wars concept of God is what we're talking about, the force. <laughs> <laughs> and it is a very dangerous concept because from where I sit, the initial statements about God are found on the early pages of Genesis. And what you find there in simple but very profound language is a build-up of a picture of God. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. So, God is a creator. But then as you go on, it says, and God said. So, God is a speaker. And God saw that it was good. So, God is the author of moral concepts. And God made human beings in his own image. And it's there, it seems to me, ladies and gentlemen, that is an utterly crucial thing. I find it against every analogy I know to think that the ultimate origin of persons is less than personal. And as far as the biblical revelation goes, God is revealed as a person. Now, why do I think the Star Wars view is dangerous? Because as persons, we are superior to forces, and we know it. We use electricity. We use nuclear energy. And if you start to conceive of God as a force, you'll soon be using God. And that's a very dangerous thing to try to do. If God is the creator of the universe, and we come, as I have done, to trust Him, it's for Him to use me, not for me to use Him. So, I think it is a very dangerous concept. And of course, the question simply asks about that concept, but there, there is another side to it, the evidential side. Uh, why do I believe God as a person? Well, because, first of all, the Bible claims it to be true, and then the evidence comes both from thinking about it in the ways that I've just begun to, but the supreme evidence for me uh, boils down to the conviction that Jesus Christ is God in, incarnate, and He is a person. God become human. And there's the focus of the maximal evidence for God as a person for me. For more information about the Veritas Forum, including additional recordings and a calendar of upcoming events, please visit our website at veritas.org.